We have the 36 restaurant, which is the fine dine restaurant, three rosettes. I've been down there for three years now. As in the five-star hotel, we have room service, drawing room. So it's, it's all, we look after everything here, basically. There's 10 chefs downstairs, uh, two breakfast chefs, then the rest are the kitchen guys. My food is like modern British, um, but I put a bit of a twist, like a, I like some classical elements, so I put a bit of a twist on, the, on my food, but it's mainly modern British, good ingredients, well sourced. Yeah, I mean, it's evolved over the last 12, 18 months of my style of food from previous jobs. Um, it's become more rustic, more feature on flavours on the plate. So that's my emphasis now is basically, and less of like the presentation, accurate side, that sort of. I'm starting to lose that from my style of food. Um, I think the goat's cheese dish with the beetroot, um, that's been on for maybe a year or so now, so it's, it's become a bit of a signature dish for me. It's evolved and we change things every now and again to make it, you know, to progress the, the flavours and stuff in it. So it's quite a complex dish, but it's, it's really good flavoursome and as I say, it's uh, evolving as we go along. I love winter as a season, to be fair. I mean, I think the quality of the produce through the winter season is it's simple produce, but you can do so much with it um, flavour-wise as well. I don't know if it's because it's been in the ground for six or seven months and comes out of winter, I don't know, but yeah, it's just the flavour stuff and game. I love working with game. Uh, so yeah, I think winter would be my best season, yeah. Wild Harvest, I mean, they're such a diverse company of what products they supply. Um, what makes Wild Harvest uh, stand out for me is the consistency of their products and the quality. It's a luxury, I mean, and the quality of the ingredients is, is second to none. Anything from, you know, the seasonal stuff, rhubarb is cracking at the moment, mushrooms, really good mushrooms. Everything they do, even from the dry products like the good quality chocolates and nuts and just very rarely get something bad and if it's bad, it comes out within an hour, a replacement, you know. So the service that way is, you can't beat it for me anyway for a supplier in London there. Steph from Wild Harvest is on the phone to me all the time. You know, morels, he had some morels coming the other day, so drop a sample in, have a look at them, see what you think, you know, crack it, okay. Wait a week or so, price to come down, then we start using them, and it's always good, and you know, they understand what you need, and you understand what they can supply, and it's just a happy medium of, of where you're at. I have nothing bad to say about them, they're a really, really good company. Really good. <laughs>